Hi, Dr. Wynn. Kelsey here with Mixed Digital Marketing. Just wanted to leave you a quick video in regards to some SEO strategies you could help you could use to implement to your website to help it rank higher in Google. So we usually go over three things. The first is content, second is backlinks, third is citations. So the content refers to words on the page. So typically regarding the home page, to have it be effectively ranking in Google, we recommend a thousand to fifteen hundred words on the home page. And each additional page, like you have on here, we recommend five hundred to seven hundred fifty words, depending on what, what the page is. And so in regards to the home page, if we look through here, although it has a really nice design, Google's algorithm can't determine how nice a page is. It, it, its algorithm can only read the words on the page. And so that's where we recommend the high volume usage of words to help Google properly determine what services you have. And so here, now these are, are clickable internal links, which is really good, but we want to have sort of a description on each of these things to help give, give you more content. And so if I were to, highlight all of these words, throw it into like a word counter. I'm assuming there'll probably be around 200 words here. So we definitely want to uplift the amount of content that you have here. Again, to make sure that Google recognizes properly the services you have and have you rank for as many keywords as possible and not limit yourself to the amount that you are currently ranking for. And so it also isn't a matter of just throwing words on there. We want to make sure that you have the right keywords, the words that get the most volume in searches each and every month. And so how we do that is a software we call it, we use called Rebs. So Rebs is a tool that allows us to plug in your URL or any company's URL. It gives us a rank, a URL rating, a domain rating, the amount of backlinks they have. We can see the backlinks, organic keywords you rank for and so forth. So it provides us a lot of good data that that we help use to um, help our clients um, rank higher in Google. But here um, I'll go into and help you understand what some of these rankings mean. So URL rating is just the, the power of your website, both internal links, external links. And so 13 is pretty good, but here you can see the domain rating of 1.6 is very low. And so this is the power of your backlinks. So the backlinks here, I know you see 15, but really what we're focused on referring domains. So this is the number of websites that are providing a backlink to you. And so this is the real number we care about, and you're only at seven. And really, if we go even further down, we see do follow. So there's do follow and don't follow links. And so do follow links are the links that actually provide you power. So really here, all you all you have are two do follow links on here. And that's, that's very, very low. We definitely would wanna recommend um, you getting as many as, as we can each and every month. And so backlinks are blog posts, influencer pages, things that allow you to leave a comment or have a hyperlink on their site that then links to yours. And so that um, with that, Google's algorithm follows the trail of that and helps build trust and power. And, um, and Google really likes that because it shows that other pages are recommending you. And, and with that, um, Google will start ranking you high and higher. It's kind of like a big popularity contest, and we want to get you as popular as possible to make sure you're ranking above all your competitors. And so with that, if we go to if we go over to Google, so I just typed in Leander Dentist. And so this search, um, exactly as typed um, right here, gets 150 search volumes per month, according to Arab, the site we were just on. And so here you can see that the ad, the ad section where people pay per click, and so roughly you can get about 20% of the search volume if, it, if the Google ad is done right. Um, but then again, that leaves 80% that's still um, not being captured. And so I'll, I'll go in and explain um, how we can do that. So this is the Google map section. So this is where you usually see a top three. Not many people click past this and go to more places. Um, the number one thing that helps people rank in the top three here is the organic rating, which um, which is right down here. And the second thing is citations, which I'll go into last. So the organic rating is what's driven by the content, as I mentioned before, and the backlink. So those are the top two things that help drive your organic ranking, which directly impacts the, the map pack. So organic rankings can get anywhere from 15 to 40 percent of the search volume, and the map pack, it being the top three, gets the rest of it. And, and it varies based on the on the num on the spot that you're in. And so your top competitor is leanderdental.com. So I'll go in and show you why they're potentially ranking higher than you. So here as we go through, I can see that they actually do not have more content to use, which is which is really interesting. And so that means it has to be backlinks. So I typed in their website in, in ROS as well. So you can see that you actually have a higher URL rating, primarily due to the fact that you have more content, more internal links on your home page, but they have a higher domain rating. 
And so and that shows how powerful uh, the backlinks really are. So they have 45 website domains, but really only 11. So this is a number that we could quickly pass up and, and hopefully reap the returns of you ranking higher organically, as well as in the map pack um, sooner rather than later. And then you can also see they're ranking for 375 keywords compared to just the 98 keywords that you're currently ranking for. And so again, that, that brings up the last thing, which is citations. So citations are online directories, pages like Yellow Pages or even Facebook and Yelp, items that allow you to list your um, Google business, your name, address, and phone number, exactly as you have set it up in Google My Business. And so, and you wanna make sure that it's exact because if it's not exact, then Google won't trust it and give you as, as, um, as much credit um, that you have all these citations all over the place. And so we also have another software um, that we use to help us see how many citations your competitors have, and we make sure we're up and beyond that. And so the other other um, amounts that affect the map pack rating are Google reviews and the and the pictures, the way they're saved, and, and things like that. But again, the number the number one and two things are your organic and your site and your citations. And so. Um, if you have any other questions, please feel free to visit our website at www.mixeddigitalmarketing.com. Thank you.